Yeah, nice to meet you. I'm going to pass these papers off. Riley, we're live on a live stream. So, um, first of all, up. yeah, right. You can, you can, though, because it's not necessarily going on TV unless you say something so incredible that we have to put it on TV. You sure you want me over here? The, yes. Okay. The answer is yes. Um, you've had an amazing year. I mean, what's it like right now having a single that's been received so well? It's been awesome to ride Thomas Rhett's coattails for the year. <laughs> Uh, such a fun song. Everybody's really enjoyed it. It's been great to see fans sing it louder and louder every week. So it's been a great year. How long have you been working toward this? I don't know if it really counts because I didn't know I was working towards it all those years. I was doing construction work and playing in bars on the weekend for, you know, free bar tab just because it was fun. You know, I always enjoyed writing songs. It never felt like work to me. So it's uh it's probably taken me 10 or 12 years to get where I'm at, but it's, uh, it's been really fun. It's nice to see things, you know, people relating to the songs and people coming out to the shows. Tell me, tell me the personal story where you decided, wait a minute, there's actually something here, and you started to move away from construction and went into music. Right? I see the eye roll, like, yeah. oh, Lord. <laughs> when they let me in here tonight. Yeah. No, I always wanted to move away from construction. My dad did it growing up, and I always helped him, and I tried to find a lot of other ways to make a living, and... Uh, I did. I built houses right up until 2018 when I signed a record deal with Big Machine. That Shut was, up. Yeah, really? first time I'd ever been to Nashville was to take a meeting with a publishing company, so it was in 18. It was, uh, wow. yeah, I didn't ever think something like this would happen, so it was cool to be here and, you know, them let me in places like this. Well, okay, so I'm, I'm picking up a lot of like, wow, I just sort of tripped and fell into this, but I just feel like there's got to be work that went along with it. I, I don't know that I personally fully buy uh, I'm just a lucky guy story. How much work did you have to put in to get there? Well... I played a lot of shows, I'll say that. Uh, carried a lot of speakers into a lot of hole-in-the-wall bars, but like I said, it was, it was always so enjoyable. That's one thing that's never gotten old to me is playing live shows, and that's why it's so great to be back and have this kind of event and the kind of normal we've had this year at touring. You know, I've been out with Luke Bryan. I'm going out with Luke Holmes and doing stadiums next year, so it's, it keeps growing, and it's fun to see the crowds get bigger. Yeah. What are you looking forward to most tonight? Alan Jackson. Anybody singing an Alan Jackson song, I'm a fan of that. Yeah. It's awesome to see people tri paying tribute to him and Loretta. This is such a such a big night for country music. Yeah, I love it. Uh, anything in particular you think people at home should know about award shows that they would never see because it happens behind the scenes? The non-glamorous, please. Uh, well, I, I would say the hours and hours of makeup and hair, but I had it pretty easy today. I had this jacket in my closet, and these are my church pants. So I, I have. It was pretty easy for me, but I feel like a lot of people took a lot of time to get as pretty as they are. Yeah, well, I mean, it's like women. Let me just tell you, women take longer than we care to admit to get ready. I don't know, Zach, behind the camera, are you able to show this man's beautiful shoes? Yeah, I think uh, the shoes are beautiful. See, I can't wear shiny boots because most of the time my clothes don't match that. You know, they're all worn out. So this is the night I slick my hair back and put my shiny boots on. <laughs> you should write a song about that. That should be your next song. Shiny boots and slick hair. Yeah. You're a co-writer. I'll give you 10%. Uh, thank you. I'll send over the contract. Uh, Riley Green, everybody. Thanks so much. Have so much thank fun you. tonight. Appreciate it. <laughs> Good to meet you. You too. Yeah, appreciate it.